Good morning, Good morning DK, DK family. family. Welcome to a new adventure, a new day oh, in Phuket. Yeah, if you're new to this channel, make sure you subscribe right down below. Come join a beautiful DK family. Make sure you don't miss out on any of our new adventures. For sure. And for today's adventure, we're gonna be doing a bike tour around the city. I we're say gonna city. To do Wait, a bike we're in an tour. island. <laughs> yes, we're gonna attempt. Yeah. That's what we're doing right now. We're outside. We're gonna go look for a bike store. Hopefully, we get some two cute scooters mm -hmm. and scoot around the city, show you some top attractions in Phuket. I googled a bike rental company and we're walking there now it should be like a four or five minute walk from our hotel so it's not too far hopefully they have good bikes and hopefully they've got good prices because my baby she wants a little little vespa looking scooter because she doesn't want anything too powerful and then me obviously i want my beast i want my 600 cc he wants to spend 400 baht only on gas <laughs> as you guys saw we have rid bikes before in phuket people do say it's dangerous but it's not the most dangerous roads I've seen. I'd say just be careful of your surroundings and yeah. pay attention to the streets. Looks like we found it. They got some good scooters. Yeah, they do. They look clean and polished. Closed? It's closed. It says it's open at 8 a.m. Goes to show, don't listen to Google opening times whilst in 2021. Hello, yes, I want to rent a bike and your shop open at 8 a.m. but no one's here. I'm outside the shop. Well, two minutes, okay. Kapun Kap. He just said that he's going to be two minutes and he's coming right now, so they must live up here or something. Saudi Kap. How are you? Are you good? You need this one? Yeah. And Taurai Kap. Uh, how many days? Huh? What about if we return, return tonight? Tonight, tonight, go. Uh, Can we return at uh, 10? 10. Uh, 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 okay. Okay, so 10 PM. from morning now to night time, 10 p.m. Uh huh. Uh, 10 p.m. today, na? Yeah, yeah, today. Go. One one day. One day. Or less than this one day. One, uh, this one, I think, I think okay for you. One day, 200 baht. Okay. And this one, 250. It's a very good deal. We're happy with that. I'm going to get this one. Gaudi's gonna get this one. I see on uh, on Google you guys have very good reviews. Oh, thank you, very thank good. you. Yeah. I, everybody uh, help me. Yeah, I'm gonna write a good review as well. <laughs> so it looks like the bike tour is on. Yeah. Bike tour is on. He's just checking the bikes for us, making sure there's no problemos. Yeah, I'm gonna do a little test ride before and I recommend you do it too, just to like know that it's the right bike for you in case you wanna change it. Hey, it's gonna be so fun, baby. Mm. Yeah. He loves his bikes. And I'm getting the little um, phone holder of mine as well, which is so cool because I don't like looking at directions. I'm like taking my phone out. It's and very the crazy thing is, we were looking at buying one yesterday. Yeah. 290 baht. No, thank you. We I don't saved want it. <laughs> so we're getting our bikes checked out, making sure that we're safe to ride. done his puppy eyes on me and helping his girlfriend, not his fiance. So <laughs> I like to see my baby excited, so I don't want to take that away from You know me. what? All, all, all serious, if it was a lot safer for me, if it was very sturdy, the brakes are good, the digital, so I'm gonna be going with this one, the safer option for my baby. I love you my fiance. We just filled up at the gas station. So what's our first destination, baby? Our first destination is Chaitararam Temple. Hey, you said it right, yeah? <laughs> I hope so. But before we go there, we're gonna go to the mall and buy a few things for the journey. I'm super excited. Let's go. <laughs>
All right, let the adventure begin. We just topped up on some food, didn't manage to get what we wanted. I wanted a hat and some electronics to hold the camera, but now we're just eating. <laughs> We just arrived at our first destination. It's so beautiful. You've got temples, you've got nationals, you've got food, you've got everything. The architecture is just incredible. They also have one of the most famous temples in Phuket right here. It's called Wat Chalong. And if I mispronounce that, sorry. There's actually a lot of people here. We just had a big coach arrive, big double decker, triple decker from what it looks like. Yeah, and they've also got food options for here. Dante wants me to sit in the back of his bike so I can feel how fast it goes or how slow it goes or whatever it does he wants me to feel and experience the same thing he's experiencing. So we're going to take a little ride around the parking lot. <laughs> this is your time to earn my trust, Dante. One, one lap. Oh. You on? Yes. Sit. Baby, stop, stop, stop. Don't misuse my trust. Okay, that's enough. That's enough. I'm ready to get off. No, oh, come on. I don't like riding in the back. We ready? We filming? <laughs> Our next location is the Big Buddha. <laughs> Our next location is the Big Buddha. From what I've seen on pictures and videos, it looks absolutely insane. The views are crazy. And we look forward to taking a picture there and learning a bit about the history if there are some locals that we can talk to. 17 minutes. Okay, start that. Bang, Let's bang, go. bang. Let's head west. We just pulled over by the side of the road because I want to show you guys how beautiful it is that the roads that we're going down. And then you got these little shops like that. Saudi cap. Wow. Hey guys, this is incredible. Baby, how beautiful are these roads? Amazing. Wow, I feel like I'm in another world. We're literally in the jungle. This is insane. We just pulled over because can you hear the noises coming from the jungle? It's so crazy. It's so relaxing. Wow. Mm. Well, let's go to the Big Buddha. We're nearly there. We're like seven minutes away. We're going up some windy hills, so we can't even record any of it. We just stopped by the middle of the road again. If you look at that beautiful elephant that's just over there chilling in his own habitat. And also guys, this is so incredible. The scenery here is some of the most beautiful thing I have ever seen. Like, wow. And I do see some elephants over there. I'm not sure how ethical their little operation is, but we're gonna go find out. That one's chained up. That is not cool. Oh my goodness. This is not cool. I don't like what's going on over here. I don't like the vibe. Elephant trekking they're trying to promote. How are 60 bucks? 60 bucks. You just got some ice creams. It's, it's so hot, it's really needed. Mm. Mm. 
are yummy. They have little seating areas here where you can protect yourself from the sun, get some shade. Cool down for a second. I'm like so sweaty. I got off the bike and my bum was sweating. <laughs> It's crazy. They weren't lying when they said Big Buddha. <laughs> Big Buddha. On pictures, I thought it was like a lot smaller and I thought it was just going to be like in a, in a city or something. <laughs> but I did not expect to have to drive all the way up and then it is huge. The Big Buddha is 45 meters tall and is the third largest statue in Thailand. Absolutely insane. So we made it to our second destination, but the question is, can we make it all the way to the top? Without fainting, because we ain't got hats on and the sun's just beating on our head. You're king! Whew. Holy cow, are you seeing this? Wow. They're doing construction in there, so that's what the noise is. If you're wondering, you can't we actually go made inside. It, guys, we made it, DK family. You made it to the top. The stairs isn't too much of a steep climb. It isn't. So it won't kill you. This is a must visit for sure. A must visit. DK I, visits. I didn't realize it was going to be this beautiful. I knew it was going to be beautiful, but this beautiful with the whole riding up, the mountains and everything, wow. Well, after taking some time to appreciate the big Buddha and appreciate the insane views, we're walking down the exit and this is just beautiful in itself. Woo! Hello, Monkey George. Peace out. What's up? That was our experience at the Big Buddha. It was absolutely incredible. There's actually a lot of people visiting the yeah, statue surprisingly. right now. Surprisingly. They're coming in groups of like 10, 15 people in these vans and then they're going up as a group. So I think it might be a tour that they're paying for. Also, if you do want to come, you just saw it's free entry. So you can just go explore for free. Very, very beautiful. Mm. I honestly recommend coming to see this place. Definitely. Now it's time to go to our next location. Tell them where we're going, baby. We're going to Kata Beach. We're going to have a nice little lunch. We're going to try to find some food stalls down there as well. Take off our shoes relax a little bit yeah. get some shade underneath a palm tree and maybe even go for a swim because yeah. we are sweating like pigs. that's a beach here we come We just stopped up at 7-Eleven for some refreshments. We're about two minutes out. Kata Beach is over there. Quick ice cream break. Oh my God. I feel like every time I turn the camera on, I look at myself, I look tanner than this video before. We made it to our third location, DK fam. This is Kata Beach. From what I can read, it's like a beach with vibes. You got music, you got a bit of things going on. You got also some food stools over there. Dante and I are starving, so we're gonna go look for some food before anything else. Fried rice, my favorite. Mm. Look delicious. They also got um, roti. Roti? Yeah. Fried rice is one option. Roti is one option. Saudi cup. Saudi cup. Want some food? Yes, hungry. Have my food, sticky rice. My favorite dish up at the beach so far has been fried rice. Yes. So <laughs> no I joke. am gonna go get that. And then what would you like, my king? There's so much. I'm probably gonna get some fruit, some fried rice with you as well. Um, maybe roti. roti. Yeah, ro roti when we leave, I think. Roti, yeah. Do you have fried rice with chicken by any chance? Yeah. Down right, Cap? Cow pad kai. Cow pad kai. Chen mai? Fried rice. Fried rice with shrimp and chicken. How much? 50 baht. Uh, that's good. Yes. It's pad thai? Pad thai. Yeah, pad thai. Yes. It's no spicy? No spicy. No spicy. Yeah. Okay, okay I'll get pad thai, please. Pad thai. Boom. 
Uh-huh. Thai kung, cream, the chicken, chicken, and chicken. Yeah. Uh, Tao Rai Cup? Uh, same. Same, same. same, same. Okay, 100 bucks. <laughs> I'm getting pad thai, Gaudi's getting stir fried rice with chicken, so I'm looking forward to tasting it. Thank you so much. So nice. When I finish, I can come back and put in a bin? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. Woo, I'm gonna enjoy this. Let's go. Get some food. One watermelon? 20 bucks. 20 bucks. 20 bucks, yes. I love the access to everything. The access to food is just so good. We're just getting a mat to sit down. 20 bucks. Where are we going? Anywhere. Anywhere now? Got a mat. <laughs> yeah. There we go. Picnic time. Ooh, my water. <laughs> Picnic on the beach. This is nice. Yeah. Chopsticks. Baby's diving straight in. How's that? Very good. Good? It's quite healthy, like it doesn't have a lot of oil or anything. I don't think I've had pad thai before. This is local pad thai. Mmm. Is it good? It's hot. That's real good. Oh shit! <laughs> Look what she done! She fully wet herself. What a donut. That's my baby donut. Hey Gaudi! <laughs> we just got changed. Gaudi's already in the sea. She's a little island girl. Look at her. Over there. <laughs> I'm all changed. We're ready. Let's go enjoy some sea. You gotta love the vibe that this beach brings. It's so beautiful to see people out and about on the beach, on the scooters. If you're looking to be around more people, definitely come to this side. If you're looking to be by yourself, go to Patong. This beach is lit. It's <laughs> We've really enjoyed being here, but now it's time to get to the next location. We're going to Karen Viewpoint. Let's you ready, go. Baby? I'm ready. Let's go. Gaudi's wearing my shorts, by the way. <laughs> yeah, my uh, pants were very uncomfortable, wet, and also there's some sand inside, so it looks just, just terrible. You look so beautiful right now. Really? Yeah, you're shining. Thank you. I feel like really weird right now because I'm dressed super weird and my hair is like all wet, Baby, wrapped up in a pony. You're amazing. Don't I worry. You. you look amazing. You feel amazing. Look at this view, though.
from this view you can actually see all three beaches you can see Katanoi, Kata and Karen Beach crazy after seeing the incredible view we're gonna go down south to Prom Thet Cape and see some more views yeah. it's gonna take 12 minutes to get there so not too long let's go have another adventure Hey, Cody. Hey, up to the Cape I want to see if I can find a dress or some pants because Dante's swimming shorts like they got that net thingy and it's irritating my bum bum so <laughs> I need to find something else to wear and besides my clothes are kind of running out again so I need something new anyway that would be nice I need something like this but white there's white there I've got some pants, some elephant pants. <laughs> Considering the situation in Patong, there is a lot of people here. Yeah. A lot. Patong is a ghost town. Yeah. But down south is like crazy. There's so many tourists. And the tourist shops are open, they're popping, they're trying to do their tourist prices. Uh it's it's beautiful to see. It's beautiful to see. Let's go see this view. There's loads of people here, which means it's gonna be good. You don't come here for no reason. You even have a restaurant over there who wants some dinner. This is beautiful. Everyone's enjoying the view. Wow. There's a time that I remember when I never fast on love. <laughs> <laughs> This day has been really wonderful. I'm very proud of us for actually getting around. The old me would have just said, let's book a guide or, <laughs> you know, I'm scared to like go around by myself. What if we don't figure it out? But we figured it out, so I'm really proud. We've got one more location to go. We're heading back to our bikes now. That was absolutely beautiful and well worth the ride. I think he'll saying hello to oh. our camera. Hey, you want to say hello? <laughs> We're gonna go around Old Town, check around what's there. Yeah, apparently really it's more excited. lively in the evening, so we just decided to like leave that to the end of the itinerary. On to the next location. We're going to Old Phuket Town. It's a 35 minute drive, slightly longer than all the drives we've been doing. We've been doing like 10 to 15 minute drives. It's starting to get dark now. We're trying to get home before it gets completely dark because Gaudi doesn't like driving in that scaredy cat. So let's go.
As you just saw, there's nothing really popping in Old Town. No, it's Old Town, like, you <laughs> it's, know, it's, Old Town. And we're definitely in the right place because I'm reading Old Phuket Town, so, you know, things are closed. We really hope you guys enjoyed the bike tour today. It was so fun. We know we enjoyed ourselves. Yes, it was amazing. I definitely recommend all of these places, except definitely. for Old Town, because obviously, as you can see, it was closed. Yeah. But I'm pretty sure that when everything's open, it looks beautiful. I was absolutely in love with the Big Buddha. It mm -hmm. looks so amazing up there. Wow. That's a must see. And must -see. if you want and you're not scared of riding bikes, definitely run a bike because it's very cost effective mm -hmm. and you can go see everything by yourself without having to book a taxi which will cost you yeah. five times as much. And or as, even booking a guide which will cost you five times as much too. And as you guys saw, like we could just stop when we want. If you saw something really beautiful, we can stop. If you want to talk to somebody, we can stop. You won't have those options if you were with a guide or with Most a taxi. Definitely. You would be a bit more limited. But don't be mistaken, whichever way you choose to roam around Phuket, you're going to enjoy it. 100%. We enjoyed it the most this way. Let us know down below in the comments if you enjoyed it and where you want to see us go next. Make sure you do not miss out on any of our adventures. We love you, DK Adventures. Woo! Let's go, baby! Uh, like that? More in front, she said. <laughs> Look, it's a nice and safety to your bank. Yay! <laughs> nice gentle stop, not like right now. Bank. Find some water. Doing <laughs> getting red. Forget about the fly, it's a fly. Did it pay for my food? No. <laughs> you gotta love the side over this side of why are you shouting? <laughs> we will be heading back to Thailand on the 23rd. So Thailand? Oh, we are heading back to boot. We are heading back to bank. We're gonna head over to our bikes now.